25 years ago, AmeriCares made a commitment to serve the patients in need in our community. In 1994, the AmeriCare's free clinics were founded to serve low-income, uninsured residents of Fairfield County. We first opened uh, the Norwalk Clinic in 1994. We opened the Danbury Clinic in 1997. We opened the Bridgeport Clinic in 2003 and our Stanford Clinic in 2014. The patients that come to our door are um, the working poor. They're hardworking individuals looking to better their health and provide for their families. Patients that need a physical to start work or um, control their diabetes or their asthma so that they can return to work and provide for their families. I've screened over a thousand patients and so I've seen firsthand the need and the need for really excellent health care. Of course our focus at AmeriCare's free clinics is adults with chronic diseases and we see patients with a lot of hypertension, diabetes, high cholesterol, and providing that primary care service to these patients in our community really you know, prevents them from going to the emergency department because without AmeriCares here, they really wouldn't have a place to go. Volunteers are our heroes. Without volunteers, we wouldn't have a free clinic. They really are at the heart of caring community. We made it to four very, very robust clinics that have provided over healthcare valued at over $100 million to 26,000 people. We're fortunate to have many programs to offer our patients. The Connecticut Food Bank has started coming to our Bridgeport Clinic, bringing in thousands of pounds of fresh food once a month. We do a cooking class with an, another group called Cooking Matters. We do a stress reduction program. I've seen patients get better and I've seen um, patients who now qualify for um, insurance and we help them navigate the system where if they are eligible, then they move on. In 25 years, the AmeriCare's free clinics have evolved and grown. I know Bob and Lila McCauley would be proud.